Yo, what up guys, Old School Daniel, and in today's video, I'm going to be sharing Robert Nalon's full body routine. So with that being said, let's go ahead and dive right into it. So who is Robert Nalon? That's a good question. Now, he was a golden era bodybuilder. He trained with many different legends like Larry Scott, Arnold, Frank Zane. He also took some of the most iconic shots for Arnold Schwarzenegger. But if you want to know more information about this guy, Nick Strength and Power has a video about him. You can learn more about him in that video because this is a routine video. We're not here to talk about Robert Nalen. We're here to talk about his routine. So with that being said, let's dive right into that. Now, for the actual routine. Now, there's many different routines in his book that he recommends. It's a little booklet that I bought. It was like seven bucks online. Pretty sure his grandson and him designed it you know, together. But um, it's a full body routine. This is the beginner routine he recommends. It's very basic and he recommends you know, someone staying a month on it before changing it. So, you know, it starts off with shoulders. Interesting because it's something sort of a reef structure. It starts off with the shoulders. Pressing, you know, everything's done for three sets of 10 reps. It starts off with the press. Um, then it moves into upright rowing for like the traps, and shoulders. It moves into the um, front squats, good for the quads. Um, and then right into the pullovers, interesting. A lot of people get confused about where they should throw in pullovers in the workout. Um, I think they can be thrown in anywhere on a chest day or back day. I feel like it doesn't really matter. Maybe even a leg day too. I feel like it doesn't matter. Um, bench pressing, good staple for the chest, mass of the chest. Um, bent or rowing, great exercise for the thickness of your back. Highly recommend keeping that one in your in your routine as a staple. Curls should, of course, be always be kept as a staple. Every exercise in this um, routine isn't a staple. Some of them aren't, but... Um, it's interesting that he's got nine sets of abs in this routine. Three, six, nine. He's got sit-ups, leg raises, and twists. There's a part in the book that I want to share with you. It talks about, you know, progression on the routine. I think you guys might really enjoy this part, so listen up. Um, let me read off to you. The first day, I start off my students with only two sets of 10 repetitions and increase the three sets of the repetitions at the next session. On the third day, I increase the weight 10 pounds on the squats and bench press. The second week, I add 20 pounds, and the third week, I increase all the other exercises by 10 pounds. At this time, the squat and bench press are up 30 pounds. So this almost seems like a form of linear progression. I'm pretty sure it's sort of the same thing. It's the same pretty much concept, adding weight every session until you can't anymore. Um, also, I think this is a great routine. It doesn't look too bad. It doesn't look like it's missing anything. It's got exercises for um, chest, back. It's got more exercise for shoulders, which I personally don't like oh no it's literally got exercises for every muscle oh, except calves there's no sorry there's no calves in this routine man that's the part that kind of sucks but again this is like a basic routine for anybody who's looking to start off like a full body routine now when you think of golden era bodybuilders in their diets you know you you think of keto diets right all protein all fats and whatnot low carb it's interesting because he when he wrote this ebook um he recommends well i'll share the routine of the um, diet with you right now so let's discuss diet I suggest that any underweight guy increases food intake, eating lots of heavy foods, potatoes, vegetables, plenty of meat, eggs, and fish. I suggest that they drink one or two quarts to one to two liters of milk per day. Damn. And take 12 desiccated liver tablets. Oh, the classic liver tablets. Great. And 12 yeast tablets per day. This is good to start improving your body. Your body is only to, going to improve with the fuel you put into, which is 100% true. Interesting. So yeah, I definitely think you can progress on a routine like this. I definitely recommend some variety over the next um, two other days. This is just like one day. And he does have another um, full body routine that I will be sharing in the future. The second routine, um, probably pretty soon. I want to share with it, that with you so that way you guys have two routines. And last thing I want to say, actually I have a few things to say. So where I search this routine from is Train Routines from the Golden Era Bodybuilding by Robert Nalon. I got this book online for like seven bucks. It wasn't too bad and you get you know a little bit of information from the Golden Era. Pretty sure it was just written by him and his grandson. Um, it's not too bad, you know, seven bucks, you get some good value from it. But last thing I wanna say is that my new ebook will be coming out for launch next Friday. Um, got it all prepped up, just kinda set up the website, trying to set up you know all this, uh, the payment methods and whatnot. But it's done. It's 60 pages full of routines that are geared to give you that Silvera look. Even the volume, the exercises, they're all, I kept symmetry and old school portions in mind. So they're like, everything is geared specifically to give you that silver air look. You know, the symmetry, the portions, all that stuff. Super pumped to share with you. This is going to be super, super sick because 
people have been you know i've been getting good feedback about the free routines that i put on my facebook group i put in a foundation routine a few different um, bodybuilding diets in my facebook group um, that people can follow for free and people are just freaking loving they're like dude these are freaking awesome I'm like yeah dude you, you may think that's cool like you know it's free and whatnot and it's good but wait till you hit, hit the paid stuff. The paid stuff is going to be way better. It's way more quality, way more time and put into it, way more thought. It's just, it's going to be freaking great, man. You guys are going to be super excited. I'm um, pumped to see this. Um, with that being said, subscribe for more videos like this. Give this video a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. I'm Old School Dan. I'm gone. Peace.